Katle Khomabo has suffered a great loss last year, especially when he actually went out on camera and admitted to his wife that he cheated on her with someone else. And that scandal cost him his career, his job, his you know endorsement, his gigs, and so forth. And uh, he was then you know removed from the Expresso show, and we haven't seen him there in a long time. We haven't seen any post from Katle since that time when he released a statement and an apology uh, to his wife. All right. Uh, what I want to say first and foremost is that now he is come back with a bang. He is nominated as best presenter at the SAFTAs and he has won two SAFTAs before for presenting. And this would be his third. If he wins this one, it, it would be his third. All I want to say is congratulations to you, Katleho. And yeah, we understand, you know, you've been quiet for a very long time. And yeah, it, it's great to see you back. And I wonder what people have to say. Are you going to be voting for Katleho uh, to win? this one and are you happy that he's back and just in the entertainment industry altogether you know it hasn't been confirmed if he's gonna be back as a presenter or anything but we do know that he's hosted the SAFTAs before he's won two SAFTAs before for best presenters and he's done things like Tropic Island of Treasure where he did a great job on he's done the Express show he did a great job on he's done outsurance you the list is endless you know his, his talent you know is is, is, is is incomparable so right now we just want to say um, congratulations to you Katleho and we really wish you the very best. Imagine disappearing for such a long time and you come back with a nomination. <laughs> oh man, sometimes the work speaks more than you can ever speak for yourself. Otherwise, my name is Andy Wardle and I am your host. Please also remember to click subscribe so that you don't miss out on any of the latest and of course the trendiest news ever. Cheers and bye-bye.